Dick Whittington's Cat is a comic colour cartoon from 1936. This one's directed by Ubai Works and written by Otto Englander and George Manuel. And to be perfectly honest, I didn't really like it. It is, in a way, the traditional story of Dick Whittington and his cat, where the cat is up against some rats and it's a good chance for Dick Whittington and his cat to make some money and make their fortune. And honestly, the story itself is okay. It maybe didn't go in the direction that I was looking for with the cat, but at the same time, I didn't really care for it. I just thought it wasn't a very interesting story. And I'm trying to think of other versions of Dick Whittington that I've seen before and none come to mind, actually. I have seen some, not many, but I've seen a couple. And I can't remember if the story is exactly the same. So if anybody knows of any key differences here, please feel free to let me know. But there wasn't anything in this that I thought was, well, there were a couple of things that I thought were a little bit outrageous. But in general, it makes a lot of sense within the context of the film. But I just didn't find it to be very interesting. And I wondered if I'd find it upsetting because I don't like emotional animal films or cartoons. But it's not even so much that. That's not why I didn't care for it. I just found the events in it to be very boring. And the animation quality is absolutely fine. I like the design of the cat. I like the design of the rats. Some of the rats are wearing clothing, which I thought was pretty good fun. So there are bits of it that visually are not too bad. I like the design of Dick Whittington as well. And there's a really nice attention to detail. So that worked very well. I think for me, it was simply the narrative. I didn't, I didn't care for it in this particular story. That's not to say I don't like the story of Dick Whittington and his cat at all. But with the comic color version, I just didn't find it to be very appealing at all. And I'm glad that this was not my introduction. I think my introduction was a pantomime version of Dick Whittington. I'm sure I went to see Dick Whittington with the brownies when I was maybe eight or nine. Don't have a very strong memory of it. And as I said, I haven't seen that many adaptations of it. It doesn't seem to be one of the more popular ones that cartoons have some fun with and that's kind of why I was looking forward to the comic color one but unfortunately while it's pretty decent visually I didn't really care for the way the story was told in this one and while I'd recommend it if you're trying to watch every comic color cartoon I probably wouldn't recommend it in general because personally I just didn't find it very good at all.